homemade chaos. <laughs> well, today's chaotic adventure is brought to you by um, a broken down furnace. We um, went away for four days over Christmas, came home uh, yesterday after four days being away and um, it was quite chilly outside, like minus 25 plus wind chill. And we discovered our furnace had quit working while we were away. I don't know which day. I'm guessing fairly early on after we left because our house was two degrees above freezing. <laughs> so it was not warm. <laughs> we, oh my. There's one, where's the other one? They're back. Anyway, we ended up having to get out of there in search of not higher ground, but warmer ground. So we quickly packed up, got out. Um, okay, can I have this? And have ended up, yeah, you can have one. Ended up having to get out of there and um, totally lost. Lost my train of thought. Bear with me. I had to come to a hotel. As you can see, we're in a hotel. So we had to promptly check into a hotel last night, feed the kids, we had to stop, grab supper, feed them, get into the hotel. We all had a hot tub because we were so cold. Our hands were like freezing, our noses were cold. It was so cold in our house. We couldn't take our coats or anything off. And, uh, hello! Anyway, <laughs> we had to get out of there in a hurry. So, oh, there's my other, he's in the mirror. Hello, in the mirror. <laughs> it's chaos. Wow. Chaos. Uh -oh. So we ended up having you to check into life. a hotel, feed them supper, hit the hot tub to warm up because we were life. so cold. Chaos yeah. of life. You're right. It, it is. It's just chaos of life. Nothing anybody can do about any of it. So here we are. We're at the hotel. And uh, I should have been vlogging last night. But honestly, there was so much happening. <laughs> And my phone was dead. Well, by the time I got home, there was no battery left on my phone. And so I had to plug it in And while well, we were doing all this. So we kind of didn't. But here we are. We're here now. So, um, yeah. We are just waiting. The furnace man just showed up. They've had a pool and a hot tub this morning. And now the furnace guy left, came and actually picked Joe up. We've had a fantastic experience, actually. The hotel is treating us like gold. They are giving us a fantastic rate because we don't know how long we're going to be here. Um, they're taking very good care of us. They've given us free snacks. They gave the kids like a chocolate bar, a free snacks this morning, a blanket. They turned on the TV in the lobby because Joe had to sleep all morning because he has to work tonight. So Joe was sleeping. Um, I was at the pool like, keeping the kids out of the room. They, the staff have been amazing. So we're having a little holiday. A little adventure and a little holiday at the hotel by the pool until we can get this sorted out. So that's where we are, and we will be back with an update later. Stay tuned. And your marks, get set, go. Go. And this is how you keep children busy and well exercised while trapped in a hotel when the weather outside is miserable. Here's our uh, homeless, we're homeless and heatless dinner buffet in, in the restaurant. We ordered some Chinese food, oh yummy. We ordered some yummy Chinese food, ginger beef, lemon chicken, some rice, dumplings, beef and veg, sweet and sour pork, Joe grabbed a whole an array of drinks and even some dessert for and some dessert and now we have a full smorg buffet going on to ourselves we have like this entire we have this the entire lobby area dining area to ourselves yeah so so, <laughs> so we're we're eating and enjoying a nice dinner. Hey, are we homeless? Homeless and heatless? We have a home. We just can't live in it right now. Mmm. 
They're awfully quiet. They must be hungry. They haven't eaten since breakfast because, you know, we don't have any food here. And they were in the pool, so they really worked up an appetite. Mmm. Bon appétit. Hello, hello. It is a absolutely beautiful minus 27 Celsius out today, which is cold. <laughs> in case you've never seen minus 27, it is darn cold. So the furnace repair guy is heading to our house right now to try to fix the furnace. He came yesterday, looked at it, needed to get the part, picked up the part last night and is heading there this morning and going to replace the part for us. And then uh, it's going to take all day for that to start working and crank out enough heat that we can actually enjoy staying there. So Daddy and Stetson are staying behind it at the hotel. Daddy's going to rest and Stetson's going to watch TV. But Fletch and I are braving the cold. C -c -c cold. It's like cold out. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell. And uh, I don't know. If... Anyway, I'll show you around after. It's freezing. So we went and grabbed coffee. It's too cold for life without coffee. So we went and grabbed coffee. And now we are heading to the house so let's get a move on and we will try to vlog a little from the house of how cold it is and the repair guy see you there okay it is so cold in here let's see these giant giant don't look at the dishes blocks of ice this is all pure ice it was in the dog dish the dog dish was outside with water in it complete froze solid and then cracked because it was expanded and smashed <laughs> apart and uh, Joe just dumped the ice into the um, sink <laughs> that was two days ago and none of this ice has melted it's been sitting there like this frozen in my sink for two days like not even close to melting so that's how chilly it's been in the house but thankfully thankfully we still have water that's at this point that's all I really care about is that our pipes did not freeze there's there's still water so we're okay. It's chilly in the house, but the furnace has been fixed and we do have heat. So that's a good, that's a good thing. It is 5.2 degrees in here. <laughs> Minus 26 outside and 5.2 degrees in here. So it's like doubled. It was 2.5 the other day and now it's coming up nicely. So that's a good thing. Killing time at the pool. Well, we're still out of our home. Careful. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Put the brakes on, Fletch. Pretty good. <laughs> You're crazy nut. You're crazy. Puppy. Puppy, puppy. You're a crazy dog. Puppy, get in your kennel. That puppy needs a cage. He's gonna fall That puppy needs a cage. What's going on? Good news. The furnace is fixed. The furnace is fixed. The temperature is slowly coming up. Indoors. Outdoors, you need to put that up. So we're packing up and we're going home. Outdoors, it's still pretty cold. Don't let the sunshine fool you. It is minus 40 Celsius out there, which I do believe is actually also minus 40 Fahrenheit. I'm going to double check that, but it's cold. <laughs> It's absolutely freezing cold out there. Even though the sun's shining, it's not warm. But our furnace is fixed, and it took longer for the temperature to come up. Uh, they fixed it yesterday morning. We were hoping to go home last night, but it just wasn't warm enough in the house because it was so cold outside. It was only 10 degrees Celsius in the house, but minus 40 outside. 
which is way too cold. So, because it was so cold out, whoop, because it was so cold out, it took the house a lot longer to warm up. So we spent one more night. Yeah, that has to stay there. And now, yeah, that has to. Stay. So it. <laughs> There we go. Pack it up. We're heading out. I know they go up there. Heading home. Smash that like button. <laughs> Surprise. <laughs> Subscribe, like, and comment. <laughs>